Hey guys, welcome back to South 10 Beer Reviews. I'm Tyler. Thank you guys for stopping by. Tonight we've got another beer from Equilibrium. Uh, this is going to be a pale ale from them, and this is going to be their Particle Physics, coming in at 5.5% alcohol by volume. This one was canned on September 1st, so we're just over three months old. Uh, today, at time of recording, is uh, December 8th, uh, but I'm not too worried about it. Especially with these heavily hopped beers. <clears throat> so, from what I've read about this one, uh, they basically took Photon, which is another uh, pale ale that they do, and they upped the ABV to 5.5, and, uh, and then they hopped it at the same rate as their Fractal Series beers. So, um, it's heavily hopped, uh, and then the alcohol is bumped up a little bit from, from the other pale ale. So, um, yeah, it should be tasty. I really love the can art, as always. Um, Equilibrium is always always doing it right. Anyway, let's go ahead and <clears throat> crack this open and get it in the glass here. <clears throat> All right. So, yeah, it's, uh, it's very hazy, actually. Uh, it's like a nice... I don't know, nice golden color, I guess? Uh, is that pale gold, though? It's like a pale color. Straw, I guess, maybe? Maybe it's, even, maybe it's more straw colored than gold. Uh, but there it is. Uh, it's got about a finger worth of pretty rocky head. If I can get to focus, there we go. Yeah, it's pretty rocky. We're using our Repeal Day glass, which I love. I just barely put some in this one, so. Anyway, let's go ahead and shove our nose in this one. Oh man, that smells really good. It's so much more aromatic <clears throat> than a lot of the pale ales out there. And like I say on every single Equilibrium review, it has that equilibrium ness <laughs> equilibrium in this. I don't know how to. <laughs> it's got the equilibrium thing going on. Uh, it all they always smell similar. And to me, I always say it reminds me of like a cantaloupe or like a melon type of, you know, a cantaloupe slash melon of some kind. Um, like a mango or something. I, I don't know. It, it just has this really nice, like tropical, like melony vibe. It's super stone fruit forward. It's big old peach in there. I mean, you do get some, like, citrus fruit as well, some orange, tangerine. Even some other tropical fruits, like some nice pineapple. Oh, it smells really fantastic. Let's go ahead and try it. Cheers. Yeah. Taste follows the nose. I will say... It's a little bit watered down, which I actually expected. I mean, it's a 5.5% pale ale. So, and also I have a, I have a um, suspicion. I don't know what I was thinking. I have a uh, suspicion that this probably had a lot more flavor to it before this three-month mark. So, um, and if it did, then that must have been a really fantastic because it, it, I mean, it really smells and tastes great though. It's got a little bit of bitterness going on. A little bit of a moderate bitterness in there. A little bit more than I expected it to have for a five and a half percent New England style paleo. Um, but it's 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 got all the uh, it's got that pillowy mouthfeel to it. Um, it's got some nice like citrusy fruit flavors in there. The orange and tangerine definitely stand out. Uh, it's also got that nice pineapple flavor. And big on the stone fruit, man. That stone fruit drives from the nose all the way through the palate, man. It is fantastic. Light bitterness. Or carbonation, sorry. Light carbonation. Uh, and then it's got a little bit of that bitterness on the back end. And this beer dries out fairly quickly, uh, which you would probably expect as well. So this is fantastic, man. I really love Equilibrium and everything that they do. Um, I think I've got a 
couple more in the fridge that we're going to get to, uh, and I'm really excited about. So, anyway, guys, uh, yeah, this is uh, particle physics from Equilibrium. This is a pale ale, and it's fantastic. I definitely recommend it. Uh, if you guys have had it, let me know. Um, you know, I also I should say, in Tennessee, we usually don't get Equilibrium stuff, but I don't know if it's like during the pandemic that there may be widening their distribution distribution to try and you know if they're not having in uh, on-site visits they might just be trying to get their beer out more to get uh you know get it all sold so um whatever's going on i i, I like it i mean it's getting me equilibrium beer and i, I love that so uh, anyway guys hope you enjoyed the video if you did please like it. leave a like and a comment and subscribe and we will see you guys in the next one cheers